volunteer, you need to volunteer to facilitate, to facilitate, to run the stack, to run, run the stack, and to uh, take the minutes. And to take the minutes. Very important thing. So important facilitator, facilitator keeps his eye on the crowd, keeps his eye on the crowd, or her eye on the crowd, or her eye on the crowd. Gestures, hand gestures that signal, that signal uh, where we are in our process. Where we are in our process. So some suggested hand gestures that we use. Some suggested hand gestures that we use are the fingers. The fingers show approval. Show approval. Um, this means that you see you don't you don't really see the point or you don't see where you're coming from, but you're okay to move forward with it. So you just kind of like this. If you completely 100% disagree, uh, you hold your hand in front of you like this. That means that if whatever is currently being discussed goes through, you will not, no longer want to associate yourself with the movement. So this is it's very serious. It means if this goes forward, I'm not going to be part of it. Uh, so use it. Be very, uh, you know, sparing. You know, think think hard about it. Uh, other hand gestures. We go like this. When we get off topic, it means point of process. Uh, it means that we need to, we'd like to get back to the point in uh, uh, whether or not we're in proposals or announcements. You know, we want to get back to the order of, of things. Uh, other things mean that people are just going to going on and on. You know, we kind of like to move, move forward. Uh, and the longer they go on, maybe you get a little. <laughs> uh, so those are kind of some of the hand signals. Um, back to facilitate. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. This also means uh, I'd like to speak, and that that gets us to what the stack does. Um, the stack the person who runs the stack, they look out for these hand signals like I was talking about. And if someone wants to speak, uh, the person running the stack will write their name down, and uh, as people finish, they will they'll call on people. Now the point of the progressive stack is to try and include. Uh, people who have been traditionally um, not encouraged to speak out, you know, so, you know, women traditionally, minority groups. So if you're running this, the stack, it's in, you know, homeless people. It's encouraged to, if you see someone who doesn't traditionally speak, to bump them to the top. That's a progressive stack. So if you see a homeless man walking down the street and he wants to speak, he wants to just say one thing, bump him to the top. Let him get his voice out there, you know, or her voice. Uh, Progressive stack. It's you know you're actively encouraging people that don't participate to participate. Um, we're we're a movement where we want to make it uh, extremely uh, obvious that we're we're trying to not have the traditional speakers you know up in front of people. Um, and then so and then minutes are the last thing. You need to have someone writing down everything that happens at your general assemblies uh, for not announcements but mainly proposals. And that's it. Proposals need to be written down just so you can post them online so people have an idea of what happens. A lot of people can't make it down here. And they're really they're really interested in what's going on. Um, okay, sorry, so that was a lot. Does anybody have any questions? Okay. If you have a question, you can go like this. Um, if you have a concern, you can go like this. Um, so that's it. I'll get out of the way. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Announcement also at two o'clock we'll be having our second second general assembly meeting to talk about committees and, and all that. And also I, I think right now I would ask if we can have a consensus on when we will have our next date for in, for our general assembly meeting besides this day. So I think earlier was Friday. Yeah. Friday. Um, when we set the next meeting, we don't want to clash with the other actions that are out there. And so please keep in mind uh, the uh, action in Riverside on the 15th, the city council meeting on Tuesday, and the big one in L.A. on the 17th. Okay, that's why the announcements usually come before proposals, so that proposals will take announcements into account. Okay. Thank you. Uh, the 17th, 17th is uh, Thursday, right? Yes. Uh,
I like to amend my previous proposal and offer that it be sat next Saturday on at noon, right here. Okay. Do we have consensus on that? Questions or concerns? Next Saturday at noon, here. I just have a suggestion. I know, I, I know I'm new here, but uh, I'm Steve Federal with the Inland Empire and Latino Coalition. And what I'd like to make an offer to you, if whatever proposal you come through, I actually meet with the CEOs of Bank of America, Brian McConaughey, Jamie Dimon, and Chase. You know, I, I was just with John Stump with Wells Fargo. What's their address? <laughs> San Francisco, 50 uh, Montgomery. Well, they, we just met at the Westin. But um, the point I'm trying to make is whatever you come up, I'll leave my card, you propose it. And I'll push it in there because we, I'm with a number of organizations where we're pushing for the banks to take the leadership roles in such things as alternative credit rating scores. Because so many of us lost our homes, our jobs. Uh, so many of us have lost so much. We've also had some meetings with David Schultz with the IRS to say, you know, we've lost everything and we still owe money. You know, we've got nothing to give. And so I'm with a couple of national organizations. I'll leave my card, I don't know who it is. If you want to get it to me, I'll talk to you. I can pass on information for people using their homes. Office of Comptroller has got a new program where you can file complaints against the banks. You'd be very interested in that. There's also the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau that's just been established. For those individuals who are seeking to get business, uh, minority and women business enterprises, the, uh, thanks to uh, Maxine Waters, they just created what's known as the Office of minority business and enterprises, and, and that's and every every single agency's got to establish that. So there's a lot out there I'd be willing to pass on to you guys. Okay, thank you very much. Move your money. Yeah. I just moved. Good. Yeah. Okay. And I have a suggestion. Um, are you guys trying to have the <laughs> every day holding signs? Maybe meet for an hour after you know. Rush hour, you know, happy hour, to uh, yeah. hold sign, yeah. just to keep it ever present. So hey, yeah. Uh, yeah. Maybe just an hour, you know, yeah. have a general well, meetup. Let me know when you meet with uh, It's up to the people. Yeah. Have a good rest of the year. Yeah. So proposal for. Well, I think my dad is going to be a So proposal. Can I do my proposal is to have a presence here every day during traffic hours. Uh, I'd like to suggest that we uh, wait for proposals on our activities, our actions, until after we have a committee. Thank you. 
Bridge. 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 Bridge.